Cadbury World is a visitor attraction, featuring a self-guided exhibition tour, created and run by the Cadbury Company. One location exists, Birmingham, United Kingdom. A second location in Dunedin, New Zealand closed in May 2018. Topic. Birmingham Topic. Overview Cadbury World was opened on 14 August 1990 by Morgan Anderson on Cadbury's Bourneville manufacturing site, and has expanded and developed its content through continuous improvement. Cadbury World has gone on to become one of Birmingham's largest leisure attractions. Over 500,000 people visit there each year especially children and students. The estate features a respected education program linking back directly to the educational advancements and interests of the company's original founding fathers. Whilst not a factory tour, Cadbury World offers its visitors the opportunity to explore and discover chocolate's history, and to learn about the origins and story of the Cadbury business, which is part of Mandela's, the world's second largest confectionery manufacturer. Topic. 14 zones Cadbury World currently features 14 zones which tell the story of chocolate and the Cadbury business through various static sets, animatronics, video presentations, multi-sensory cinema, interactive displays and activities, and staff demonstrations. These zones also include the Bourneville Experience. Opened in 2007 replacing the Cadbury Collection Museum, which explains the background to the development of the site on which it is located and 4D Chocolate Adventure, constructed in 2014 and replacing Essence, which in turn replaced Cadburyland before it, and which incorporates a 3D cinema. Topic. Dunedin Topic. History In July 2003 another Cadbury World was opened in Dunedin, New Zealand. It is located in the Cadbury factory site at 280 Cumberland Street, close to the city centre near the Octagon. This is one of the largest factories in Dunedin that also offers tours and has become very popular with tourists visiting Dunedin. In May 2009 renovations were carried out inside the Cadbury World Visitors Centre. The attractions which had existed since the opening were taken out, and new areas were added, including an Aztec-themed room and Old England room. Unlike the Cadbury World in Birmingham, it offers guided tours around the manufacturing area of the factory. On the 16th of February 2017, Amanda Banfield, Mondelez's area vice president for Australia, New Zealand, and Japan, confirmed that Cadbury World Dunedin would remain open despite the company's decision to close the Dunedin factory by March 2018. She also confirmed that Mondelez was planning to redevelop the Cadbury World Dunedin site. In April 2018 Mondelez received permission to move Cadbury World to a separate building close to the factory site in Castle Street in central Dunedin, which would allow for a major expansion of Cadbury World. The new premises, which would include a cafe, retail area, an outdoor playground, and interactive activities, is due to be completed by late 2018, and would be open every day of the year. Expectation is for annual visitor numbers to increase as a result from around 120,000 per year to around 200,000 per year. On 4 May 2018, it was reported that Cadbury World would be closing down to make way for a new $1.4 billion New Zealand dollars hospital to replace the existing Dunedin Public Hospital. 
Mandela's had previously announced last year that while most of the Cumberland Street site would be sold, it would retain the old factory for a redeveloped Cadbury world. Mandela's Vice President Banfield confirmed that the former Cadbury site had been sold to the Ministry of Heath for an undisclosed amount. It was reported that the closure of Cadbury World would lead to the loss of 39 jobs. Topic. Tours The Dunedin Cadbury World offers three different tours, the Factory Tour, the Shortened Tour, and the Center Tour. The Factory Tour takes approximately 75 minutes, and incorporates a 10-minute self-guided tour around the Visitor's Center before a fully guided tour through several areas of the operational factory. Chocolate Samples including fresh liquid chocolate, are given along the way, and the tour culminates in a five-story decommissioned crumb storage silo, inside of which currently is the world's largest chocolate waterfall. The factory tour only operates on weekdays, the factory does not work on the weekends. As a result, shortened tours are offered on Saturdays and Sundays. These tours do not venture into the factory, instead a DVD is played in which shows weekday operation. The final tour option, the center tour, is purely self-guided around the visitor's center. All tours end up in the Cadbury World Retail Outlet, which has chocolate at discounted prices compared to supermarkets in Dunedin, and unique, novelty souvenirs. Topic. See also Cadbury